Now we're entering the actual festival. Knights in shining armor. Yeah. <laughs> she fell. <laughs> oh. So this is a cherry tree. Oh, a bunch came. Whoa, it's working. Ooh, we could go in and wash those. Yeah, they're the ones with the like Well, everyone slept wonderfully last night. There aren't darkening shades here, so everyone was up pretty early. We're exploring outside. We turned off the video games, and so we're done with that for the day, which is gonna lead to a lot more fun and exploring outside. There's a really cool oh. adventure park yeah. right next to us. One at a time so it doesn't splash too big. Is it good? It's sweet. Ish ish. Ish ish. Are you gonna be able to get down, buddy? Okay, please be really careful. It's easier to go up than come down, huh? Too much. Good job. Now, now you're on. You got it, bud. There we go. <laughs> and then from there you fall to your death. <laughs> well, we are having a nice slow morning over here, which is desperately needed after all the traveling we've been doing. I'm doing the dishes, and as I'm sitting here doing the dishes, I'm looking out the window and I'm thinking about how many different windows I'll look out this year doing dishes. How many different sinks I'll do dishes in. And dishes is such a it's such a human task, you know, it can feel mundane and boring. And yet putting it in different settings. I've really been enjoying it. Just grateful for the chance to have a home to be staying in and to be doing the dishes, so. <laughs> this kitchen has a little peephole into the living room. We can serve you food from here. Or I can just check on everybody. Let's leave that open. Look, it's extra bright. I love it, it's a little pass-through. And a sneak way in. Ooh. You're gonna try to get in this way? Yeah. It's the sneak way. <laughs> I didn't ever think of it as a crawl space. It's basically a door. And you're in. The emergency exit from the living room. Made it. What is it? I'm Marco Poloing my friends. Who are you Marco Poloing right now? My grandma. <laughs> Perfect. Well, my iPhone is saying that this is a plum tree. What the plum? Oh, yes. They are not ripe. So these are still just growing. Well, as I was just talking to Elise, she <laughs> she fell out of the back of the hammock. I didn't know how to do that. Uh, almost did it again. Be careful. <laughs> oh, there's plums all over the floor. Baby plums. I think these might be different. These are from this plant. I just got a text from my aunt and she and my cousin are walking over to say hello and I'm so excited to see them and introduce the kids to them. And I think we're gonna all head to the park together. So our house is in that corner and this park is right here. And it's huge. This is perfect. This is amazing. <laughs> you, that, that tire just kicked your butt. <laughs> <laughs> that was a rough ending. So we are walking to my aunt's house. It's just about a 10 minute walk and meeting up to have some lunch together before heading to the big festival that's in their town. So because Aunt Shauna lives here, we knew we could send some things through Amazon and these scooters we thought were perfect because we were gonna be doing a lot of walking and the girls can just ride the scooters around. Also, we told you before how we got hacked, which has been a huge headache. Again, it was nice to have an address here where we could send the updated credit cards to, and this morning we got refunded all the thousands of dollars that had been stolen. Yay! Yeah, at least most of it. Not all of it, but most of it. Yay! Woo! We still don't know if we're gonna be able to get our Facebook page back though. Yeah. It might be gone. It's a lost cat and we have to find it, it's so cute. Oh man. It reminds me of Sunny. Just before we go to the festival, we're stopping by Shauna's house. They have some turtles in their yard. When you wanna feed a turtle, you just sort of see if they go for it. They're really going for it. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> Did it really snap that out of your hand? Yeah! That was fun. It's like feeding the moose, eh? And then they just take it. 
It's just. Um. Um. This is Josie. Josie's probably 20 years old, 20, 25 maybe now. So look in here. There's more turtles in here. There's three more. Janae's in turtle heaven. So I grew up in Arizona. It became a state of the United States in 1912. This city has been around for over 800 years. And so their celebration covers a totally different timeline. And look, yeah, like. <laughs> <laughs> my family. Hi. This is dancing. You like the drums? So this is the largest brick church steeple in the world. How are we gonna walk up? we got the more you could hear it reverberating around the walls what I think is cool is it seems like all the adults are playing pretend because they're all dressed up yeah and they're like doing a story which is yeah. what I do with the little girls yeah it's very cool what's coming nice nice and shining armor yeah Janine, should we get some ice cream in Germany? Yeah. Yes. They're gonna do the spaghetti. So they put the vanilla in and they squeeze it in. Whoa. Do you see that? That just makes ice cream better, I think. We had spaghetti for lunch and now for dessert. <laughs> Oh, you just went with ice cream. Well, I know you guys aren't gonna finish them. Oh, you think? Hello. One of the really cool parts of this celebration is that you have to be here from Lansu to be one of the members of the celebration. And Shauna, Kendra's aunt, has known so many people because she's lived here for so long that they know the people from the community that are here in the celebration dressed up and playing the different parts. Elise, the braids today were very appropriate. I keep seeing that hair style. Yeah. You so, fit right in. what is the time period like? Okay, this, this happened in 1475. Okay. The original event that they're recreating. So the main event that they're recreating happened in the 1400s, and it was an important wedding. And so everything behind this fence is kind of like a play where we're just getting to watch and observe what life would have been like back in the 1400s during that time. I want a carrot. Hey, y'all yes. It's really good. A little bit of Here, I'll take a little bit. Thank you. Are you watching the girls dance? And play. Such a big group, it wasn't easy to get a table, but we did find a spot. So we're pretty, we're, we're pretty proud of ourselves. Oh, <laughs> my 
What do you think of playing the drums? Good. Yeah. He's speaking to me in German, and I didn't want to like be like, oh, I don't speak German. <laughs> this is my first time eating corn on the cob. After having braces. The Brunner's Wurst, which is the sausage that we tried, this giant pretzel, the chicken wings, the corn on the cob, it has all been delicious. I don't think that that's edible. It might be styrofoam. Do you think that that is? It is edible. It's a cone. Okay. <laughs> How genius is that? So now we're all eating our baskets. Eat your food and your basket. How's the basket? Doesn't taste great. <laughs> Whoa! Okay, that's still. <laughs> he just threw it all the way over the river. And we heard it hit. I was like barely making it halfway into the river, so that was a far throw. Caleb's learning how to juggle. Isaac said he knew how to juggle. But he's never done it with pins. <laughs> Janae, did you like seeing the princess? Yeah. What was your favorite part? Yeah. We're heading back in through the old town. There's still so many people. What do they have? A PSP! 